Welcome everyone. The first way to log apps is I want you to search for and open up the shortcuts app. And from here, I want you to tap on automation. And then either tap on the plus at the top right or create personal automation. From here, you're going to scroll all the way down until you see app and select app and you see run after confirmation run immediately tap on run immediately on the older software this may say something different just select what is closest and make sure notify when run is turned off and then we're going to see app tap on choose and just choose the apps you would like to lock in the future, you can change what apps you want or don't want to be locked. So we'll tap on done when we're ready and just make sure is opened is ticked and is closed is unticked. Now let's tap on next. And then if you see an option to add commands, just skip 10 seconds. But if you see, um, you know, get started, my shortcuts, then just select new blank automation and now we can go into add action or search and we're just going to search for lock and then we should see this one lock screen or lock the screen if you don't see this you'll need to update your iphone software version and if you still don't see this then skip to method two which is in this video so we're going to tap on lock screen to add it. We are then going to just play the automation so it saves and you can see it will just lock the screen and then we'll tap on done. And so when we open up an app, immediately locks, you need to uh, enter in your face ID or passcode to unlock. Boom, really fast, really cool. In the future, you may want to add new apps so just go into the automation area of shortcuts, tap on the automation, tap on the apps, app again, and just add or remove the apps you would like. The next way, and this allows you to set your own custom password, so you can have a different passcode to unlock and a different passcode to lock apps, is I'm going to have this iCloud link in the description. So iCloud is an official Apple website. And you can see this is a shortcut I've created and this will lock apps for you. So just tap on the get shortcut option and it should bring you to the shortcuts app. You may need to manually copy the link and pull it in the Safari browser for this to work. And then we're going to tap on add shortcut. And once the shortcut is added, we're going to locate it. So it should look like this. Uh, we're just going to long press on this one and then we're going to select duplicate uh, we just need to create a duplicate and this will make sense in a couple of seconds so we're going to tap on the triple dots for the duplicate and you're going to see here ask for enter passcode to open any app you want to lock so in my case I'm going to lock the Instagram so I'll just make sure this says Instagram put the app you want to lock here so if you want to lock Minecraft put in Minecraft for example TikTok pull in TikTok just pull in whatever application you are trying to lock now we see here one two three four this is the pin to lock the app so if you don't want to have a pin of one two three four go in here change the pin maybe you just want 1111 for whatever you want there then we see here open tap on the app and choose the app that you would like to lock so in my case we are locking instagram so we'll just tap on the instagram if you're locking tiktok you select tiktok and once we have done all of this we're going to tap on the arrow here now we're just going to rename this shortcut to, uh, we'll just do app locked 
and then the app name. So app locked Instagram. We now need the app icon for the app we want to lock. So this is very simple. Open the app store and then search for the application you want to lock. So Instagram. Once you found the app, take a screenshot. So take a screenshot, power, volume up, click release, tap on the screenshot and just crop so that you have the app icon. Okay, so just cropping, so we have the icon only. There we go. And we'll tap on done and then save to the photos. Once we've done this, we can create the locked app and pull it on our home screen. To do this, we're gonna tap on the share icon and then we're going to add to home screen. And we're gonna get rid of this app lock stuff because this is the name of the app which will show on the home screen. So we just want that to be now Instagram, for example. We're then gonna tap on the app icon. We are then going to choose photo and we're going to choose the icon that we took a screenshot earlier. And now we're gonna tap on add. And there's a couple more steps. So right now we have the locked Instagram app. You can see here, it wants the password. However, we also have the regular Instagram app, which has no password. So what we need to do is we need to long press on the original app, which does not have a password. We're gonna tap on remove and don't delete the app, just remove from home screen. If you delete the app, then the locked version will not work. And so now we tap on the app, it's gonna run. It wants the password. Let's try an incorrect password. See incorrect pin and you're denied access. Let's try again and let's put the correct pin. Immediately we enter in the application and there is absolutely no issues here. Remember to duplicate this original app locked uh, shortcut and you need to create a shortcut for every single app you would like to lock. With that being said, if you would like to help support the channel, please do check the description. Bye bye.